briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2002, the New York Supreme Court Appellate Division ruled on the case of Bonifacio v. 910, 930 Southern Boulevard, LLC, which focused on a property owner's responsibility for defects in a building they lease. The case arose after a man was seriously injured when an elevator in a Bronx building dropped from the fourth floor to the first. The property owner, 910, 930 Southern Boulevard, LLC, was sued for defects under Multiple Dwelling Law, Section 78. The owner claimed that they were not responsible for the defects, as they had leased the building without reserving any right of re-entry or inspection. However, the court denied their motion for summary judgment, doubting that the owner had completely relinquished control of the building through the lease and finding it unlikely that they were exempt from multiple dwelling law section 78. The court held that the dismissal of the complaint against the owner was premature without further information about the relationship between the owner and the net lessee or the lessee's notice regarding elevator issues. The decision by the Bronx County Supreme Court was upheld, and the motion to correct the record was granted. This ruling established the principle that a property owner cannot escape responsibility for defects in a building they lease by not having a provision in the lease that allows them to re-enter or inspect the building. All judges on the case agreed with this outcome. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.